Okay, what we've got here is your future transition. If your name is Michael Jackson, then it was like M. Jackson at futuretransitions.com. And we gave you a mailbox last year so that when somebody sent you an email, it would come in here and these messages would come into your mailbox and that's where they would reside. What we've done now is we've given you a new mailbox, a mailbox by Gmail. And the Gmail box, of course, is much bigger. You'll never run out of any space or anything in there. We give you small ones here. Some people, we, we made them a little bit larger so you can get more messages in there. So what we're doing with the Gmail mailbox is <clears throat> we've given you the web, uh, the email address. If your name is Michael Jackson, it would be ft dot M Jackson at gmail.com. So the only reason you would need that email address is to log into your Gmail. That's it. You're not going to be giving that email address out to anybody. You won't be sending from that email just to log in to check your email. Now, when you log in and you do a compose, there'll be a drop down menu that you can use this email address or your future transitions email address. And the default is the future transitions email address. So all you gotta do is select that and send your messages as normal. Anybody from the outside world, whether it's regional center or your, your, your spouse or whoever it is, if they send email to this future transitions uh, account, it'll automatically end up in there. And remember, this is a huge mailbox. You'll never run out of space. You can go back a year or two years. I go back two and three years and look and see email that somebody gave, sent me and you know, do a search, and you'll never run out of space there. So any emails that come here will automatically end up in here. Now, right now, they're ending up in here too, but pretty soon this is going to get so full, but we'll have to go in there and say, hey, when you send it over there, just delete it from here, and all your emails will be over here. So... This is the only reason you need this email address is to go to gmail.com. When it asks you for your login, this is what your login is. You already have your password. You should have that by now. You can use this to compose. You can set up your signature in this mailbox so that when you send out email, it'll show your name and your signature at the bottom, and we're going to show you how to do all that. All I want you to know right now is that this mailbox where you've been going to for the future transitions you don't have to worry about that anymore. You don't have to go there. You can go straight to Gmail, or if you go to the website and click on the mail icon, it'll take you to this spot in the future. Okay? Any questions? Good. Let's go. Everybody.